Yechezkeel Ezekiel 44. Then he brought me back the way of the gate of the outward sanctuary, which looks toward the east, and it was shut. Then said Yahuwah unto me, This gate shall be shut, it shall not be opened, and no man shall enter in by it, because Yahuwah, the Elohai of Yashadael, has entered in by it. Therefore, it shall be shut. It is for Eth the prince, the prince, he shall sit in it to eat bread before Yahuwah. He shall enter by the way of the porch of the, that gate and shall go out by the way of the same. Then brought he me the way of the north gate before the house, and I looked, and behold, the glory of Yahuwah filled at the house of Yahuwah, and I fell upon my face. And Yahuwah said unto me, Son of Adam, mark well, and behold with your eyes, and hear with your ears, at all that I say unto you, concerning all the ordinances of the house of Yahuwah, and all the Torah thereof. And mark well the entering in of the house, with every going forth of the sanctuary. And you shall say to the rebellious, even to the house of Yashara'el, Thus says Adonai Yahuwah, O ye house of Yashara'el, let it suffice you of all your abominations, in that ye have brought into my sanctuary strangers, uncircumcised in heart and uncircumcised in flesh, to be in my sanctuary, to pollute it, eth even my house, when ye offer eth my bread, the fat and the blood, and they have broken eth my covenant because of all your abominations. And ye have not guarded the watch of my holy things, but... Ye have set garters of my watch in my sanctuary for yourselves. Thus says Adonai Yahuwah, No stranger, uncircumcised in heart, nor uncircumcised in flesh, shall enter into my sanctuary. Of any stranger that is among the children of Yashara'el. And the Leviim that are gone away far from me, when Yashara'el went astray, which went astray away from me after their idols, they shall even bear their iniquity. Yet they shall be ministers in my sanctuary, having charge at the gates of the house, and ministering at to the house, they shall slay at the burnt offering and at the sacrifice for the people, and they shall stand before them to minister unto them. Because they ministered unto them before their idols and caused the house of Yashara'el to fall into iniquity, therefore have I lifted up my hand against them, says Adonai Yahuwah, and they shall bear their iniquity. And they shall not come near unto me to do the office of a priest unto me, nor to come near to any of my holy things in the most holy place. But they shall bear their shame and their abominations which they have committed. But I will make them garters of the watch of the house for all the service thereof 
and for all that shall be done therein. But the priests, the Leviim, the sons of Sedach, that guarded at the watch of my sanctuary, when the children of Yashadael went astray from me, they shall come near to me to minister unto me, and they shall stand before me to offer unto me the fat and the blood, says Adonai Yahweh. They shall enter into my sanctuary, and they shall come near to my table to minister unto me, and they shall guard at my watch. And it shall come to pass that when they enter in at the gates of the inner court, they shall be clothed with linen garments, and no wool shall come upon them while they minister in the gates of the inner court and within. They shall have linen bonnets upon their heads and shall have linen breeches upon their loins. They shall not gird themselves with anything that causes sweat. And when they go forth into the utter court, even into the utter court to the people, they shall put off at their garments wherein they ministered and lay them in the holy chambers. And they shall put on other garments and they shall not sanctify at the people with their garments. Neither shall they shave their heads, nor suffer their locks to grow long. They shall only pull at their heads. Neither shall any priest drink wine when they enter into the inner court. Neither shall they take for their women a widow nor her that is put away. But they shall take maidens of the seed of the house of Yashareel, or a widow that had a priest before. And they shall teach us, my people, the difference between the holy and profane. And Cause them to discern between the unclean and the clean. And in controversy, they shall stand in judgment, and they shall judge it according to my judgments, and they shall guard at my Torah and at my statutes in all my assemblies, and they shall hallow my Shabbathoth, and they shall come at no dead person to defile themselves, but for father, or for mother, or for son, or for daughter, for brother, or for sister that has had no man, they may defile themselves. And after he is cleansed, they shall reckon unto him seven days. And in the day that he goes into the sanctuary, unto the inner court, to minister in the sanctuary, he shall offer his sin offering, says Adonai Yahweh. And it shall be unto them for an inheritance. I am their inheritance. And ye shall give them no possession 
in Yashara El. I am their possession. They shall eat the meat offering and the sin offering and the trespass offering and every dedicated thing in Yashad El shall be theirs and the first of all the first fruits of all things and every oblation of all of every sort of your oblations shall be the priests. Ye shall also give unto the priest the first of your dough, that he may cause the blessing to rest in your house. The priests shall not eat of anything that is dead of itself or torn, whether it be fowl or beast.